Island, and we will see Frances back with us. I know she needs to work out transportation. And then I have a thank you from Elizabeth. And, you know, in the, the short time that the Ware family has been with us, I think we all have become very attached to Elizabeth, and we didn't want her going out to Utah for a while, but so while she was gone, we sent her a goodie box, and she wrote, Dear Hamilton Church family, wow, thank you so much for the wonderful box. Every single gift is so thoughtful and makes me feel so loved. Snacks, gift cards, school supplies, notebooks, gum, and so much more. Everything in there reminds me that I have an amazing church family. Thanks to all of you for your notes, texts, calls, emails, gifts, and your thoughts and prayers. I am so incredibly blessed to be part of a loving, wonderful church. I miss you all so much, and I can't wait to see you. And I was thinking about it, so I was going to share this thank you note from Elizabeth and what we did for her, and I was thinking, we have a problem. Her brother is here today. <laughs> I didn't you anything. <laughs> but I think we have to be here. We have to attend it so many days. So many days. <laughs> we're just under the line. <laughs> Any years in five. <laughs> Thank you, Elizabeth. So if you stay right here for the next six months, maybe you'll get a box. <laughs> Little update on our remodeling. It is progressing. There was some work done that you can't see today because we have choir risers in front of the electric conduit, etc., that was run this week. And we did have a meeting with the HVAC people as that's getting designed to get that in here. So things are progressing. And something I was asked to do last week, and I totally forgot until this morning, that was to make yellow sunshine cards. So I guess there are going to be a weatherman. I'm going to say there is no sunshine this next week. And that's my fault. I will have yellow sunshine cards here next week, and maybe my wife will help me remember, and maybe somebody else might send me an email to remind me. Time for prayers and praise, and Skip Evans has been able to come back home. John, I was looking for you over here. Give us an update on your father. Uh, Dad is home. His dialysis went well. He's uh, on medication. He's sustained, uh, tired. But he's very happy to be home. We uh, worship together, sang together. God is good, wonderful. I just want to thank Jesus today. And Dad's doing well. He's resting. Thank you, John. How long will you be in town? I don't know. Um, whatever God's will is. Okay. Amen. Well, give our best to your father, and I'm sure there will be phone calls and some visits. Is he up to visits at home? Any other request? Melvin? Pray for my daughter. Lord touches that went to uh, Canada that arrived safely. My son and his family went from Carolina to Carolina. They arrived safely, but it cost them two hundred some dollars. They got a speedy ticket. <laughs> <laughs> One of little sap out of the vacation. But they're doing well. They arrived safely. And, and <coughs> praise God for them. We weren't able to talk to the police officer and to extend any grace for them. Any other requests? Mike? Uh, prayers for the uh, Conley family for the passing of James Conley last night uh, from pancreatic cancer. Mm. And some of us remember Jim Conley. I knew that he had been ill.
Any other issues? Yes. If we can remember, those in other countries right now, I know they're adding that luck in one of the number of our own people in France and in, around Turkey and that area. Yes, the world is in chaos. And when is this? The week of the 25th uh, of July. Uh, coming up here in soon? Yeah. Okay. And what's your daughter's name? My sister. Sister? Nancy. Nancy.
we read responsibly our call to worship for today. On this new morning and every moment of our lives, gracious God, from generation to generation, we praise your holy name. Like our ancestors before us, we proclaim your greatness to our children. For we have seen your deeds of power and witnessed your goodness in our lives. And you have opened your hand to all, satisfying the desire of every living thing.
We are so thankful we rejoice today because we were able to bring to you our gifts. We ask you, dear Lord, that you will accept these gifts that we have brought. Gifts of thanksgiving, gifts of praise. Lord, you have been with us and we know it. Our barns are filled and our paths are overflowing. Lord, thank you so much. And so we ask you to bless this offering. Help there, Lord, that it will go towards finishing the work in this area and worldwide. We pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen.